What's poppin' YouTube? Today, we at Yogi's Tire Shop. This is gonna be the first part of the uh, Cadillac Fleetwood, uh, I guess, do's and don'ts. So, in this series, we're gonna, um, we're gonna do a dash swap. After that, we're probably gonna do a motor swap. Then we're gonna do a, um, maybe some floors. I don't know yet. We'll see. But he got his Fleetwood. We got a couple of parts cars over there. I'll show you in a second. And we're gonna get busy with this. So check it out. Dude, bro. <laughs> I'm telling you, bro. I believe it. I, I think I was, I was the originator of motherfucker do it. You gonna blow up. What you mean I'm gonna say something about toxic rides? All right, so I'm gonna take y'all out back, see what we finna work on. You know, you got some nice little toys out. Bug, the Ford. Oh yeah, you know what that is. So this is what we're gonna be working on, right here. So he got his Fleetwood up on the rack right now, but we gotta do some things to uh, get it where it need to be. So since he got this one, we are gonna go ahead and start stripping it down. So I'm gonna show you guys how to do a dash swap. We're gonna take this dash out, do the 90 swap on his 80s. And I'm gonna show you step by step how to do it. So we get with you. All right, so we finna start taking out this dash pad couple of screws you got to get to but I'm going to start installing it and then our in start uninstalling it and then I'm going to show you exactly what screws need to be taken out to get the dash pad out all right so now we got to get out these screws right here so it's two screws on each vent we'll go ahead and pull that out all right now since we're gonna do a full dash swap anyway I don't know how good y'all are going to be able to see this, but we got some screws yeah, right here. Uh, we got one over here, and we got one down at the bottom. So I'm going to go ahead and take this out because we're going to do a full dash swap anyway, so there's no need for me to even keep it in there. All right. So now you got screws done over here. Two on the side. You got your vent screws. Then you had the ones inside of here. After that, your dash pad should release. So you just go ahead and pull it forward. All right, we back on the other side here. Go ahead and pop out your door pad, your dash pad, and then you're good to go. So it's not that difficult to do two screws one on this side one on the other side you got your vent screws which are right here inside the vents just un unscrew those a little bit and they're, they're going ahead and come right out then you pull it forward after you get the uh, bottom screws then you pull it forward and your dash pad should come right out with no problem and that's how you take out the Cadillac dash pad easier than you think so go ahead and try it follow the steps and you shouldn't have no problem but this is just the first part in this series because soon we're going to take out the whole dashboard do a dash swap i'm going to show you how to do the wiring everything to make everything go pretty smooth so like and subscribe to the channel toxic rides baby i got you kind of like shit we own it